excellent mold, resplendent ragwort, fantastic spores. This will replenish my supply nicely, Azriel. Then I can get to work on a new formula to destroy those rotten smurfs. <coughs> Out! <coughs> Azriel, stop your mindless playing while I... Shh! That sounds like smurfs. <coughs> <laughs> Look, Azriel, fairies, and, and they're burying something. Queen Lenon should be pleased. Yes, the fairies of the forest have honored her well. <laughs> we'll just unearth whatever little goodies they were trying to hide, hey, Azriel? <laughs> perhaps it was food they buried, or perhaps... Azriel, get out of there! <laughs> Look, Asriel, what have we here? <laughs> gold! I've struck gold, Asriel! Real gold! I'm rich, rich, rich! This is power, Asriel! This is wealth! <laughs> I'll buy jewels, fine clothes, eat like a king! Laugh at me, will they? Mock me, will they? Now be good, Azriel, and I'll bring you a nice surprise. <coughs> oh, what is this? Some varlet has stolen our gold. But who could know where it was hidden? What have we here? Aha! Perhaps the thieves. Hang on, Clumsy! Smurfin' hand. No, Clumsy. Fairies cannot be trusted. Oh, they can't? How come? Well, they just can't. That's right. They're real troublemakers. Gee, I never had any trouble with them. Uh... Let's go back to the bridge and tell Papa Smurf. Yeah, come on. Are fairies really bad? Uh... Muffs! I should have known. Little rascals. First they steal our gold, then attack me. Well, they won't get away with it. Well, pretty. When my little Smurfs return with the new beans, repairs will be almost completed. I probably should have gone with them, Papa Smurf. There is no telling what kind of trouble they'll get into out there without my intervention. In fact, Papa Smurf, Papa Smurf, Papa Smurf, we saw a fairy. Yeah, and he tried to run us down with his horse. And he looked real mean. Uh, yeah, and he was hurt when he fell off his horse and... Hurt? Did you smurf him a helping hand? Why should we help a fairy, Papa Smurf? They're mean. And sneaky. And funny looking. For once, they're right, Papa Smurf. I heard fairies even bring bad luck. So, you didn't smurf him a helping hand because of rumors hearsay? But, Papa Smurf, we didn't think that... <laughs> you unworthy blue Smurfs! I demand you return the gold you stole from us! That's him, Papa Smurf. You see how mean he is? I want the gold. Return it now, or I shall be back in force to take it. But you are quite mistaken. We have no need for gold, nor do we steal. I shall return and destroy your village. I hate fairies! Strange. Most fairies are peaceful and friendly. But this young prince is convinced we have wronged him. Do you think he'll really come back and destroy our village, Papa Smurf? I don't know, Brady. But I must journey to the fairy kingdom and straighten out this unhappy matter. Goodbye, my little Smurfs. Be good. Bye! Bye. 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 Listen, Smurfs, we better be ready in case those fairies do attack. You're right, Hefty. I don't even think Papa Smurf can stop them. 
But Papa Smurf can handle anything, and I should know because I'm his assistant. And when I speak, Smurfs listen. Therefore, something tells me these Smurfs are in listening. We'll turn the village into a fortress. No fairies are going to destroy our village. Yeah, we'll show them. Smurfs can't be pushed around. Especially by fairies. I hate fairies. I'll buy silk things and jeweled rings and a feathered velvet hat. We'll turn our house into a palace. Think of that, dear cat. I'll hire a crew and have them do exactly what I say. A butler maid and wizard's aid and a personal valet. We'll hop a ship and take a trip to places near and far. We'll travel light and see each sight from here to Zanzibar. It's no more hovel, no more grovel, no more toil as well. It's first-class seats and satin sheets for the rich new Gargamel. La -da -da -da. <laughs> oh, how magnificent you are. Oh, wonderful wizard. Truly magnificent. <laughs> and good day to you, kind sir. I have here a little proposition a man of your obvious means cannot possibly pass by. I can't. You cannot. I know you've heard the old saying. I have. You must spend gold to make gold. You must? Behold, from far Cathay, the one and only Gold Sniffer. This unique creature has the amazing ability to sniff out gold. Sniff out gold? Shh. Yes, sire. All the gold an honest gentleman could ever want. All the gold I could ever want? Yes, sire. There is no other creature in the world like this one. I promise you that. Alas, our uh, ill fortune forces me to sell it far below the market value. Oh, Asriel, do I have a surprise for you? <laughs> Don't be frightened, Azriel. Let me introduce you to Nugget, a most rare and precious creature. I'm sure you will be the greatest of friends. His talented nose is going to sniff out all the fairy gold in the forest. Eat, my pet, eat. Soon you'll be going to work. <laughs> Ah, Nugget, my pet. Enjoy, enjoy, for there is work to be done soon, soon! Those thieving blue smurfs will pay for their treachery. I'll see to that! Mother! Mother! Oh. I'm glad you have returned safely, my son. Mother, the gold from the fairies of the forest was stolen by Smurfs. Stolen by the Smurfs? Oh, are you sure? Yes, Mother. They also attacked me. You must be mistaken, Garth. I know Papa Smurf and know him to be honest and most pleasant. Perhaps so, but the others are nasty and mean, and I'm taking the fairy cavaliers and getting our gold back. Oh, by force? I will not permit this without proof. Look elsewhere for the gold thieves. No, Mother. It is clear to me that they are the thieves, and therefore the enemy. With all due respect, perhaps you're too old to see this clearly. Too old? Indeed. Onward, my cavaliers, for gold and motherland! For gold and motherland! Look out, towers already, Hefty! Oh, good work, Handy. Now we need a lookout. Scaredy, you can be our first lookout. Who, me? Climb up there? Right. All you have to do is yell when you see the fairies. Okay, but I'm afraid of high places. Calm down, Scaredy. You're upsetting the others. I won't look down. I won't look down. I won't look down. And there's lots more where this came from, Handy. Yeah, yeah. Wait till those fairies get scurfed by a few of these. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what are you doing with all my pies, Jokey? Duty call, sweetie. We need those pies for self-defense. Give me back my pies. Oops. Mmm, yum. 
Ah, Kathy, we could use this against the fairies, too. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> okay, Greedy, this is how you make a fairy trap. Mmm, <laughs> this is my kind of trap. Uh, say, could you Smurfs on stick me? Can't now, Crumpty. I'm busy. Yeah, me too. Uh, okay, thanks. <laughs> ah! Ah! The fairies are coming. The fairies are coming. I don't see any fairies, Scaredy. We should be coming upon the fairy kingdom any moment, Feathers. It is now. Yes, Garth has told me of the unfortunate incident, Papa Smurf. And frankly, I am worried he may do something foolish. That is why I am here, Queen Leonon. Pardon me, Your Grace. I have looked everywhere for the prince and discovered he has departed with the Cavaliers. The Cavaliers? I was afraid of this. My ill-tempered son has left here against my wishes. Then we have no time to lose. Let us go together and reason with him before it is too late. The Smurfs will pay for taking our gold. They will pay dearly for Motherland! Clumsy, look! They're coming! Oh my gosh! It's the fairies! Uh, better yell a warning, Scaredy. You're the lookout! The fairies are coming! The fairies are coming! <laughs> to get any sleep around here. Blow the walls down! Nothing can stop us now! <laughs> Into the village! Take to the skies, Cavaliers! Show them what we're made of! We'll take care of the Smurfs, Prince God! Smurf the catapults! Smurf the catapults! Oh, so you want to play her up, huh? Come down here and fight! <laughs> like a Smurf! We've got to be real accurate with this one, Jokey. Yeah, this is going to be a Smurfy surprise! <laughs> they won't know what hit them. Wait, wait! I can't let it all go to waste. Oh, no, it breaks my heart. Well, this load ought to stop those no-good fairies. Uh, yeah, I hope something stops them. I hate fairies. Dodge! Here they come! Think of how rich I'll be, Azriel. I can live in a castle, eat the finest food, wear the most fashionable clothes. <laughs> Stupid nugget! You're supposed to be finding gold, not eating smurf berries. <laughs> nugget! <laughs> Just kidding, Nugget. You're nearly there, Queen Leonor. Good. I pray we're not too late. Look there! Uh, now, let's be reasonable about this nugget. I found fairy gold under a stump. Now it's your turn. I paid good money for you, and I want my money's worth out of you. So, it was that terrible wizard who stole our gold. I should have known Gargamel was behind this. Now let's hope we can straighten this whole mess out. Smurfs! The 
listen to me. I have information. Sorry, Papa Smurf. Smurfs, hear me. It's Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf, the fairies attacked us. Yeah, but, but, but we're winning. You were saying, miserable Smurf. Stop this fighting. Listen to me, Smurfs and fairies. There must be peace and friendship between us. I will never be friends with a thieving Smurf, Mother. The Smurfs did not steal our gold, Garth. It was the evil wizard, Gargamel. Gargamel? Yes, Gargamel. And to prove our friendship with the fairies, my little Smurfs, we are going to help them stop Gargamel from stealing any more of their gold. You know, if you don't find me some gold soon, Nugget, I shall have to consider the possibility of your becoming a rug. Aha! Now, don't you find this tree rather interesting? Hey! Nugget, you fool! Get over here! Nugget, you found it! Gold, gold, gold! Beep, beep, beep! What's happening to us? Gold! We must be near gold! Oh no! This must be a magical dream! This is fairy treachery! Ah! This is where we saw Gargamel. It looks like he's been busy. Look, Mother! Someone has entered the magic tree! Who would dare violate our world? Gargamel! Then he's on his way to our kingdom! We must stop him, son! Ah! Riel, look there. It's really true. There really is a fairy world. Oh, I'd be rich, 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 rich. <laughs> look at this gate, Azriel. Some gold. How fortunate. There seems to be no one here. Oh, how very fortunate. This roof alone is worth a fortune. Solid gold, emeralds, rubies, all fine! Oh, I'm so happy I can weep for joy! <laughs> That's Gargamel! Look, Mother, he's plundering our city! Oh, magnificent fortune, magnificent fortune! A king! I'm as rich as a king! <laughs> this is terrible, and it's all my fault for having left it unguarded. Oh, don't blame yourself, Prince Garth! We all make mistakes, including me. Prince Garth, Hefty, is everything ready? This ought to slow him down. Ready up there? Gargamel is coming out. We're ready. We'll travel light and see each sight from here to Zanzibar. It's no more hovel, no more grovel, no more toil as well. It's first-class seats and satin sheets for the rich new Gargamel. <laughs> Quiet, you stupid cat. Fire away! Who was that? Oh, stop it! Gargamel, you are to leave here, never to return. Smurfs? Here amongst the fairies? How delicious. I think I'll stay for dinner. <laughs> you think you can defeat the great Gargamel with pine cones and acorns? <laughs> we fairies can do much more than that. Ah! My new clothes! Stop! 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 I'm going! I'm going! Ready with the tomatoes, Papa Smurf! Fire away, Handy! Ah! <laughs> Quick, Azriel! Back into the magic tree! Ah! Be gone, evil wizard! I'm leaving now, but I'll be back for all that gold! <laughs> Papa Smurf! Queen Lionon! Gargamel says he'll be back! Well, he's gravely mistaken, Hefty. He'll never find us again. We must remember where this magical tree is, Azriel, for our return trip. <laughs> What's happening? 
Oh no! Gone! All that gold lost! I want my gold! I want my gold! <laughs> oh no! And we thank you again, good Smurfs, for all of your help. And now, my son and his cavaliers will accompany you back to your village and assist you in repairing the damage. Thank you, Queen Leonard. Today, we have all learned something. I have. I shall never again be so suspicious and quick to judge others. I always thought blue was bad and Smurfs were different. Well, uh, we are different. Uh, yeah, and I kind of like it. <laughs> Variety is the Smurf of life, Clumsy. All Smurfy and end Smurfy. It is a surprise! <laughs> <gasps> <laughs> well, I guess I deserved that. See what I mean, Mother? You just can't trust a Smurf. <laughs> <laughs>